Hey, welcome in. Quick date check for you. It's, uh, yeah, November 11th. Yes, somehow we're in November. That's not the point, though. You know the saying, 11-11, make a wish? Well, even though nobody told me, because you can't do that with a wish, I know wholeheartedly what every NMSU Aggie fan was wishing for today. Yes, a win over Western Kentucky to punch their ticket to the Conference USA title game. So would the wish come true? Things not looking good early. Down 14-0. to zero. Aggies on their first time in the red zone. Settle for a field goal but the next time it was seven points Jonathan Brady rushes in from 10 yards out for his first rushing TD of the season and they'd be in again a mere eight minutes later Diego Pavia finding Trent Hudson for the one hand catch for his seventh of the season and the first Aggie lead of the day 17 unanswered to take a 17 to 14 lead but Western Kentucky with six seconds left in the half regained the lead 21 to 17 Austin Reed to Craig Burt Jr and the score would stay that way right until three minutes left in the third when Pavia finds his backup QB and the Aggies Swiss Army Knife, otherwise known as Eli Stowers for the score. That his first receiving TD of the year. And what a time to do it with a conference championship game on the line. So Stowers gets the lead back and then he makes it a two-score game all on his own at quarterback this time. He keeps it and runs it in. The Hilltop is now in need of two scores with 4.14 left on the clock. But instead, Mackay Miller picks off Reed and takes it 57 yards to the house. Signed, sealed, delivered, Aggie fans. Your wish comes true. NMSU beat Western Kentucky 38-28 to to grab their sixth straight win, eighth of the season, and book their spot in the Conference USA Championship game, their first year in the league. From the worst team in college football to start 2022 to now a title game, take a bow, Jerry Kill. I'm just kind of numb right now. I don't know if you understand. I mean, i just kind of in shock, really, and... Uh, but uh, it means a whole lot to me because I've coached 40 years and doing it with these group of kids and being in Las Cruces, we got a lot to feel good about. And, uh, you know, I told we, we have a right to celebrate tonight and then we go on the next one. But uh, I don't care right now. It means a lot. We, you know, the whole week people was doubting us, saying Las Cruces, New Mexico State, not much. So we just had that chip on our shoulder and, like, getting this – getting to play again and get our revenge on Liberty, that's that's what we live for. Yeah, you heard it there. The Aggies will have a rematch with the now-ranked Liberty Flames in the Conference USA title game on December 1st in Lynchburg, Virginia, with kickoff set for 5 p.m. local time. Until then, the Aggies will finish the regular season with Auburn and then Jack State back at home.